so hi guys in this video we are going to talk about how you can score 60 on 16 physics section for iid and for that i will give you five advices or five tips which will be very crucial and important for you for your iit exam so without wasting any time let's begin okay so the first tip or the crucial advice i would suggest is for iit 2025 that you should follow a reference book for your concept understanding and for the problem solving also at my time, I used to use HC Verma and SL Aurora for my uh, JE mains preparation because from the starting itself, I was not preparing for IIT but uh, for JE mains. Later on, I just moved for the IIT. So yeah, so the first tip which I am sharing with you is follow the reference book. So for uh, like from my side, I would suggest you that you should follow HC Verma for the clear and conceptual understanding and SL Aurora is also good. Uh, the language is so easy. So I used to refer this to book but I would suggest you guys to follow HC Verma. Okay, so let's move to the second point second most important thing or the second most important tip or advice i would like to give you all is that do j men's past year questions at least you should do 10 year past uh, questions of j men's so that you can at least get the level of uh, iit questions or like you can reach to that level of iit questions as well as j men's uh, i would suggest that you should uh, do from 2011 to 2024 that is more than enough uh, you don't have to go from like past like from the beginning of the j men's or j advance uh, it's fine that if you do at least 10 to 15 years uh, previous questions of JMN. So, okay, so that's it for the second advice. Let's move with the third. Okay, so the third most important thing and which is basic thing also and I'm sure that everyone is following this third advice which I'm sharing in this video is that you should do all the PYQs of IIT from 2017 onwards to till date. Okay, because this thing will give you an idea of how questions are being asked in IIT, what level they ask and what kind of questions uh they ask right the, the way of asking you will get to know that okay so these types of questions they ask so i will prepare according to them okay so that's it for this third advice if you are all if you are just solving the second and the third advice or you are just following my second and third advice i'm damn sure you will do 12 to 13 questions of iit in physics section uh, no one is going to uh, steal your those uh, 13 or 14 questions of iit the fourth tip of this video and it is the most important which will help you for to score 60 on 60 in physics is that you should solve six uh, top 500 questions of math and go which will really help you for your iit preparation and uh, i also have made this video before uh, for of math and go top uh, 500 questions but i thought to put that thing in this video because i was making to score 60 on 60 so why not right so i am damn sure if you are following the fourth advice also from the second third and fourth because at this point the first advice that we follow at Sivarma is kind of impossible for IIT 2024 aspirants but i'm definitely uh, recommending uh, to 2025 aspirants that you should follow at Sivarma for your preparation okay okay so the fifth most important thing which is the end of this video but like you should do even though you are not following math and go top 500 questions still it's fine but the fifth is like most crucial and most important for your IT preparation is that to give test okay it is not mandatory that you for physics you should give full length test or something if you are not confident in the particular chapter you can give a chapter wise test from the anti abhyas app or any of the material you are using or any of the institute test series you are using okay it's it's fine and if you want to solve uh, if you are giving like mock test for the full length then it is also fine just that you should follow and you should do mock test and analyze it that is the most crucial thing and it is applied for all the subjects it's not that you just uh, do this uh, mock test kind of advice just for the physics not for that but for all of the subjects you are doing okay whether it is chemistry maths or bio or three of them and anything okay oh, wait my camera okay sorry uh, so that's it for this video i guess it's like i have covered almost all the sections all the five advices which i have uh, told you to uh, do just follow it properly and yeah even though if you're not following the first uh, first advice it's fine but please follow the four advices which i have told because it's really gonna help you a lot and it, really if you are a week in physics and you are just doing these four advices which i am telling you then it is like totally worth it for you guys and you are gonna like uh, uh, physics section will be the easiest section for you if you are following these four advices okay so that's it for this video hope you like this video and yeah keep studying bye bye